Hello, hello, hello. Chris McClellan here, the Joy Connector, with a little more light on the subject. And I was going to pull a card for you guys, and you know what? I thought I'd rather riff, um, because there's so much going on that I think it's helpful to talk about it. Um, so the first is, if you have been feeling a lot of change, or you're in a position that feels kind of uncomfortable because you recognize you are going through change, stay there. Do not run away. Uncomfortable is a sign of growth. So say yes, like a big fat yes to it. And um, that's the topic of this video. Um, lean in and say thank you. So if we have not met, I'm Chris McClellan, The Joy Connector, and welcome to my channel. If you like my videos, and there are plenty here for you, over 100, uh, with uh, spiritual guidance like this in the spiritual toolbox, weekly readings, um, that where I'll pull cards and do readings for you, and then um, bits on meditation as well. So um, please like, share, and subscribe this video. Okay, hit the notification bell too, and you'll be notified when I have new videos come up. So back to the topic. Okay, so um, what do we typically do when something's uncomfortable? We step back or try to change it and try to make it comfortable. And that is resistance to change. And that is what creates suffering around change. <laughs> so in order for anything really great that I've been able to see, um, I have to be a bit uncomfortable. I have to be through some sort of discomfort in order to move through change. Um, I'm going to have to feel all those feelings now. Um, do I um, have to kick and scream with it? No. Um, do I have to be punished? Am I being punished? No. It's just the nature of change. Um, it can make us feel uncomfortable. We can feel uncomfortable around it. And um, because it's growth, it's just part of the deal. So um, the best thing we can do, and I'm in the middle of it right now, um, I just was actually in a car accident over the weekend and for sure it was uncomfortable and everybody's okay. Everybody's okay, which is really number one. That was really my primary concern while it was happening. And then as the weekend wore on, I thought, and I started to, you know, add up costs in my head. I was like, should I be worried about this? The answer is always no to that. <laughs> Why is this happening? Well, there's something here for me. Um, nothing is happening by mistake in the universe. So, so I can lean in and say, thank you. I am an agent for change. Thank you for taking care of me. What am I here to do? What am I here to do? I'm on board. Let's do this. What do you need me to do? What's my next right step? That lack of resistance, that acceptance, that gratitude, that okay, I'm on board. That sends the winds in your sale, um, makes everything easier, sets you forward. <sighs> um, go ahead and breathe a sigh of relief and know I'm in it, I'm in it. And um, it's always for my good. Change is always for my good. Whatever's happening is for my good. Whatever happening is happening right now, I'm gonna lean in and say thank you even if it's not what I wanted or expected. And there's going to be a lot unexpected that happens in life. That's what I've noticed. That accident happened at the very start of a vacation that I've been planning for weeks and had many, many ideas about how it should go. <laughs> I had a great little mini vacation, none of which was how I thought it should go. None of it. None of it. And yet the things I really asked for, wished for, wanted from that vacation. So all of that to say is lean in and say, thank you. Things might get uncomfortable and there's growth in there and we're always being brought higher. It's always for our good. If there's always something better, it's this or something better. So if things are kind of looking a little weird or going sideways, that's for you. You got me? So, yep. Thank you, universe. Let's go. Thank you, universe. Let's go. Thank you, universe. Let's go. Love you guys. See you next time.